that fire and explosion happened a little further up the street from where we're standing. We're still being kept back uh, for safety reasons. The house and everything inside is just in pieces, and it could take investigators quite some time before they know exactly what caused this blast. It could be heard from miles away. The blast so loud and explosive, it destroyed this home and killed the couple living there. 74-year-old Ray Troutfetter and his 69-year-old wife Janet. Their entire two-story home on Louthan Road, the bricks, wood, and insulation, plus everything they owned. Their mattress, mail, photos, all memories of the life the two shared now scattered on the ground. Nothing but a pile of smoking rubble from where their house once stood. We were concerned that there was people in the house sleeping, which turned out to be the case. The Trout Fetters lived at this home for years, according to police. Sky 4 was over the destruction as investigators sift through the debris trying to determine how it started. Initial reports suggest a new gas tank installed at the house may have sparked the explosion, but investigators say it's too soon to confirm that. What they do know, the blast was heard around 4 a.m., and it was so powerful, people living in several nearby communities felt the shake and called 911. We had numerous calls. It was heard from several miles away. So, yeah, throughout South Beaver and Chippewa, Darlington, uh, it was a pretty loud explosion. The Beaver County coroner tells me autopsies are scheduled for later today. I've learned from a family member who did not want to go on camera that the couple did have children, uh, but nobody else was living in that house at the time. Stay with us, though, as we learn more about the victims and the exact cause of this blast. We'll have the latest tonight at 5 and 6. For now, they're reporting live from South Beaver Township. I'm Amber Nicotra, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.